Good day learners! This module was designed and written with you in mind. It is here to help you master formulating the rule in finding the end term using different strategies and differentiating expression from equation. The scope of this module permits it to be used in many different learning situations. The language use recognizes the diverse vocabulary level of students. The lessons are arranged to follow the standard sequence of the course, but the order in which you read them can be changed to correspond with the textbook you are now using. The module is divided into two lessons, and this is the second part, differentiating expression from equation. After going through this module, you are expected to differentiate expression from equation. This is quarter 3 of module 2. Finding the end term of a sequence and differentiating expression from equation. And this is lesson 2, differentiating expression from equation. In the previous lesson, you have learned how to formulate the rule in finding the end term using different strategies. In this lesson, you will learn to differentiate expression from equation. Find the next three letters and figures in the following patterns. Write the answers on a sheet of paper. Letter A, 5 over 6, 6 over 7, 7 over 8, 8 over 9, 9 over 10, 10 over 11 and 11 over 12. Letter B 3x, 5x, 7x, 9x, 11x, 13x. For letter C, A plus B, A plus 3B, a plus 5B, A plus 7B, A plus 9B, A plus 11B. Then now, try to answer letters D, E, F, G, H, I, and J. And time starts now. Expression is a mathematical phrase that uses variables, numerals, and operation symbol. Expression, the sum of a number, and 10 divided by 2, see as a number. Pwede mo siyang isulat like this. And also this. And you can read like sum of a number and 10 divided by 2. Equation is a mathematical sentence with an equation sign which shows that two expressions on either side are equal. Equation the sum of a number and 10 divided by 2 equals 7. C as a number or C equals 4, you can write like this. And also this. An expression has no equal sign. There is no definite answer and cannot end up displaying the value of the variables involved. Here are examples of expressions. 
3 times 10 divided by 5 in symbol Seven added to the product of four and six. You can write that in symbol like this. Another. The sum of nine and twenty-one diminished by fourteen. In symbol, you can write like that. Five times seventeen less twenty. You can write this symbol like this. Another 93 decreased by 42. And symbol, you can write like that. Answer the following questions on a sheet of paper. Number one. What are the mathematical terms used in the phrases? 2. What terms denote addition, subtraction, multiplication, division? An equation contains equal sign. It shows answer or ends up representing the value of the variable. The following are examples of equations. The sum of a number and 7 is 15. That is, twice a number decreased by 10 is equal to 8. You can read that 12 is added to the difference of a number and 16 the sum is 55 another twice the sum of a number and 2 is 18 the following are examples of expressions and equations place them under proper column inside the box below do this on a sheet of paper. Then continue this activity Fill in each blank with the correct answer to complete the statement. Choose from the words inside the box. Write your answers on a sheet of paper. Number 1. Mathematical statement wherein two expressions are set to each other is called an equation. Then continue this number two and number three in your own. Write whether each number is an expression or an equation. Write the answers on a sheet of paper. Let us answer letter A. That is equation. Or letter B. That is an expression. Then try to answer letter C, D, E, and F. Find the next three terms in each sequence. Then write the rule for finding the end term. Write your answers on a sheet of paper. Letter A, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. The rule is 5N. Letter B, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15. The rule is 2N plus 1. Then continue this by answering letter C, 
D, and E. For letter F, 20, 16, 12, 8, 4, 0, negative 4. The rule is 4N plus 24. Or 24 minus 4N. Letter G, 2, 5, 8, 11, 14, 17, 20. The rule is 3N minus 1. Then continue this by answering letter H, I, and J. Draw a box if it is an expression and a triangle if it is an equation. Write your answers on a sheet of paper. Letter A, that is triangle. Letter B, that is box. Then continue this by answering letter C, D, and E. For letter F, that is expression. So, you will draw box. For letter G, that is equation. So, that is triangle. Continue this by answering H, I, and J. Look at the expressions and equations below. Write EX or X if it is an expression and write EQ if it is an equation. Perform this on a sheet of paper. Letter A X Letter B EQ Letter C X Then Continue this by answering letter D, E, F, G, H, I, and J. And time starts now. Maraming salamat muli sa inyong panonood. Hanggang sa susunod nating videos, laging mag-ingat, alam.